Right, g'day guys, Clint here for dropshipdownunder.com.au Today I'm going to be talking about selecting an authority dropshipping niche and, uh, and all of that entails. So with that, let's get cracking. Right, so selecting a authority dropshipping niche now i've done a ton of videos guys on you know dropship selection and uh you know how and why i pick my niches right but at the end of the day it all comes down to selecting an, uh, a, a niche where you can build authority around it and what i mean by that is not a big general store okay and i want you to think about niching right down okay so now today i'm going to use an example which i use in the dropship down under course which is um, fishing, fishing, okay, the, the, the fishing niche. And what I mean by niching down and building an authority is I would still consider the, the, the fishing niche itself to be a general store almost, okay? There's just too many things out there, you know, rods, reels, uh, you know, lines, lures, just, you know, tackle, boxes, everything like that. Everything that is included in fishing for me is a little bit too general. And how we, how we select our niches, we niche right down. So we select a niche within a niche, okay? So using the example in the dropship down under course, we used the fishing, but what we did is we focused in on fishing reels only, all right? So what the idea when selecting a niche is niche right, right down and build an authority store just on a certain part of a niche, okay? So using the, using the, um, the reels for, as an example, right? The idea is it's very hard to compete with the big boys, right? With all their keywords and all their advertising budget and everything else in between. But with our smaller advertising budgets and and uh, niching right down, we can focus in and zero in on a store that may have three or 400, 500 different reels, okay? All of our content is, is reel specific. All of our blog posts are reel specific. All of our social media and everything we talk about is reel specific, you understand? <laughs> reel, not reel. But um, do you understand what I'm saying? So that you become the authority on reels. Generally, you'll have a bigger selection of reels, for example, or a bigger selection of whatever you've niched down into, right? Um, than, than the big boys, because they've got a store with hundreds of thousands of items. You know what I mean? They've got tons and tons of items where we are really niche specific and you become the authority within that niche. Does that make sense to you guys? Do you understand what I'm getting out there? Not only that, you'll be thinking, well, that's a very, very small niche. I'm not going to make many sales, okay? Well, let's look, let, I want to break that down as well and, and dispel that myth as well, okay? Let's think about this for, for one second. If you're selling high-quality fishing reels, right? At, at, say we're using, you know, we're, we're, we've got big game fishing reels and they're going for between 600 and, I don't know, two grand plus, right? The difference between that and everything else is you, 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 you have the, you know, you're building that authority by um, having, I've lost my train of thought a little bit there, stand by, <laughs> no, yeah, by having only those reels, right, all you need to do is sell um, between, for example, let's use a thousand dollar reel for an example, and you're making 30% 30, 30 margin on it, okay, right, you only need to sell 10 of, 10 of those a, a, a week to be doing around, around 3k, okay, so all you need to do is steal from here and here and here, 10 sales from all of the big boys, and you're, and you're looking at 3K, 3K a week. All right, now imagine you started doing that a day. But let's just let's just focus on 3K a week, right? And after everything, maybe you're left with, after you know all your Shopify fees, advertising, everything like that, you might be left with two grand, right? At the end of it all, right? At the end of the day, if you're, <laughs> if you're doing that a week, two grand a week, and call it eight grand a month, you can sell that store, right? At eight grand a month, you get 20X, after 12 months of running your store, you will sell, you'll be able to sell that, that store for the, the average of what you've been doing each month over those 12 months. So call it eight grand, okay, for fun. You can sell that store for almost $140,000, guys. Do you understand what I'm saying? These niche stores, they, <laughs> it's not small potatoes. Do you understand what I'm saying? You can make a good living with a really niche down store. Your, your ads, are, ads are cheaper, they're higher for targeted. You don't have to worry about um, competing with the, the big boys so much because you are the authority. Does that make sense? You understand what I'm saying? Getting that, guys? You don't need to be selling thousands of items every day, every week, right? You need to be selling one or two, three on really good high ticket items with decent margins. 
Okay, so that's what I'm talking about when selecting a authority dropshipping niche. That's what I'm getting at, guys, okay? So I could talk about this all day. I'm, I'm quite passionate about this because this myth that you need to sell thousands of items and you need this huge authority, this huge general store, with, you know, and cover all these products, you just don't need to. You don't need to. You need to be selling between 10 and, 10 and 20 products, high ticket items each week, and you'll be making a killing, guys. Right? That's all there is to it. That's the, that's the difference between what we're doing and selling thousands of items on AliExpress at a dollar profit a pop. It's, you know, it's less work, less hassle, less returns, just as good profit, if not more, and you're building a real business and an authority website that's, that's saleable, okay? All right, guys, I'm going to wrap it up. If you like the vid, give me a big thumbs up. Uh, comment below if you've got any questions. I really like hearing from you. And obviously, subscribe to the channel. And uh, basically, until next time... Um, Oh, I better, I better also mention, if you want to find out exactly how we do what we do, head over to dropshipdownunder.com.au. That's, uh, you know, that's the course that we've developed for fellow Aussies that uh, to want to learn how to dropship step by step. Me and Grant have put a ton of work into that, so check it out, dropshipdownunder.com.au. And yeah, I'll wrap it up now. <laughs> Sorry, I've waffled on enough. But yeah, um, until next time, guys, keep living the dream, and we'll talk again soon. Cheers, guys.